can reason get the job done? Yes, it can. Do you need to know how to actually use the doll? Yes, you do. What's up, everybody? My name is Chris Reed, and today I want to talk to you guys about why I use Reason 12 to make my beats and musical compositions. I've been using Reason since version 3 and have been using the DAW as my primary system for over 15 years. During that time, I've tried other DAWs, including Ableton, Fruity Loops, and Logic Pro, but I've always stuck with Reason as my primary DAW. The Reason Factory Sound Bank alone was one of the draws for why I chose Reason when I first began using the product. I had tons of drums, bass, guitar, piano, all kinds of synth, orchestra music, all kinds of brass, strings, woodwind, just all of these different sounds, as well as synth instruments, they really drew me into the program. I was getting sounds and hearing quality that I wasn't hearing in other dolls in their factory sounds that they gave you. I want to say that I came to Reason because of the sounds, but stayed because of the workflow. The way that the rack, sequencer, and mixer are laid out now really allows you to see the entire picture of how your music comes together. Starting off with your instruments in the rack. Your instruments, effects, utilities, and players, they live inside of the rack. And that is a window that is separate in itself. But then you also have the mixer, which is SSL modeled, which means that it looks beautiful and gorgeous, but it sounds good as well. And it gives you the ability to do all the panning and leveling and EQing that you need to do just as you would if you were inside of a major studio or if you were using any other doll that has a mixer. But it gives you send effects, it gives you bus sends, it gives you compression, it gives you parallel compression. There's so many features that the mixer allows you to use. But not only that, the sequencer, the way that you are able to organize your music to create clips and to create notes and note lanes, to be able to manipulate all of your MIDI notes at the click of a button using the tool window. Window. to be able to transpose, change your audio, fade in, fade out, cross fade, and also being able to bounce audio files into Rex files for using things such as sampling inside of the Kong or inside of the Dr. Rex loop player really just allows you to create a multitude of genres of music. You're not limited in the style of music that you can create, but with the sequencer and piano role that Reason has provided, you are able to manipulate your musical performances or create music just simply by drawing in notes on the piano roll. overall organization of reason is really appealing to me because what you see in your rack is what you see in your mixer and it's what you see in your sequencer. Everything comes together, including your names and colors that you apply to your different instruments. It all comes together and it flows nicely. This is not like a reason love story where I'm just saying all of the great things about reason and I have no complaints or, no, or any gripes. And trust me, I hear you. There are other features that other people have complained about that they wish that they had that reason just does not have. For me, none of those things are keeping me from being able to create the music that I want to create. 
which means I can be even more excited for when those features are included because now those features are not a crutch for me to make my music, but instead they can actually be an added benefit on top of the music I was already being able to create. I understand that a DAW is a tool and it's really about who is using the tool, not so much about the tool itself. Can Reason get the job done? Yes, it can. Do you need to know how to actually use the DAW? Yes, you do. My point is this, Reason has grown in the past and it continues to show its users how it can grow in the future. When I look at Reason as a DAW, I see the trajectory of Reason. I see the fact that it has tons of growth potential and I want the program to grow with me as I grow in my music production so that the music continues to change and get better and develop and be better than it was before. So with that, the software is updated frequently. And now with the addition of Reason Plus and sound packs, that means you're getting tons of new loops, instruments, patches, rack extensions that are being updated continuously to the Reason ecosystem. Speaking of those samples and loops and loop libraries, Reason sound packs really work well with the software. It's not like other sample libraries where you have to drag and drop or download and then add it to your folder. When you install a sound pack from Reason Sound Packs into your Reason DAW, it's right there ready to go immediately. You can open that folder and see the samples, the loops, the, the entire song file. You can also sometimes have access to just the individual samples used in that sound pack. And so really, it just gives you the ability to have the potential to have more and more more music to have more and more ideas and musical ideas come to you each and every month with the subscription service. And for people who are not like me, who prefer a different workflow or who, or who prefer a different sequencer with their DAW, Reason has allowed you to be able to use Reason sounds, effects, utilities, players as a plugin inside of your DAW. That just shows me that Reason is planning to be around for the long haul. They are here to be here for musicians. It's not just about you using their product and their product alone. Why would Reason do this? I think they would do this because they want to provide something for musicians. They wanna give you the ability to be able to create your music even if you're not using their DAW. So you're not limited in your music production in any way. can you make different types of music and you're not limited in the genres of music that you make but actually creating the entire song and reason is capable now you can create your musical production your beat 
as well as record audio into Reason as well. And unlike other programs where you are just going to have a two track or the stems to those files. But if you're recording your song in Reason, you actually have access to all of the instruments as they have been played, as well as adding in your audio into the file as well. So you have complete control of your entire song when you record your entire song in Reason. So when it comes time to process your sound, including mixing and mastering, you have the capability of doing that inside of Reason as well. When it comes to making music and choosing a DAW, I know that price is important as well. And for me, it was really important. I chose to look at it as an investment. I invested in myself by purchasing the entire software. Others who are not willing to make that investment investment into themselves and into their music career can choose the option of using Reason Plus. And Reason Plus is a subscription service which allows you to use Reason the entire DAW and as well as have access to the sound packs and rack extensions for one low price that you pay monthly. And right now, you can try Reason Plus and the entire Reason DAW first for free by downloading a demo of Reason, but you can also have your first month of the Reason Plus subscription for just $1. So these are the reasons why I've chose to continue to use Reason 12 as my primary digital audio workstation and why I will continue to use it into the future. I'm looking forward to all of the updates and changes to the software that are soon to come. And I'm excited about the opportunity to make music with Reason using its program and all of its added features and benefits. If you have not used Reason as your primary DAW, I encourage you to give it a try. And if you need any tips or tools or tutorials, you can subscribe to my channel where we have tons of tutorials on how to use Reason to make various kinds of beats. Again, my name is Chris Reed. I hope that you guys enjoy this video. Until next time, peace.